comes the lumber for the walls and roof sheeting and side sheeting. Well, there it is, man. Fresh off the truck. Boom. All the lumber for the shop build. There's the boxes of Simpson Strong Ties. So Framer comes first thing in the morning. I'll bring you back then. It's all the studs getting pre-cut to 11 feet, one inch to be exact. Uh, things are moving along quick, man. First wall standing. Look at that. That was one heavy song, bitch. Just got the other wall up with the door opening. Moving right along. Hot as hell here, man. Anyway, we're uh, forging ahead. This is after day one of framing. And yeah, we'll take a little walk around. We had two guys uh, for about six hours. We got up to two side walls. We got our pressure treated plates um, screwed down to the stab bolts. The back walls almost framed out and ready to put up. We'll do that in the morning. Uh, these walls are 11 feet tall and then with the trusses that I have coming it's going to give me a 12 foot uh, 4 inch clearance on the inside so we're going to hit it again uh, tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. so far so good man forging ahead progress is good it was about uh, 95 here today it's going to be about 100 tomorrow by about noon so we're going to try to get the heavy stuff knocked out early here's a little video of the front side probably going to get blown out by the sun but Coming together, man. Day two of framing has commenced. Today we're gonna get all the walls uh, finished up, put up, and then the outside uh, sheeted with a half inch OSB. That's the goal for today. And I'll take you along as we make progress.
That's one of the four by sixes uh, for the hold down to the slab. We have eight of those required by the city for stability. It's so your building won't lift in the event of an earthquake. Again, eight four by sixes, uh, full length of the 11 foot wall. And then it's uh, attached below with a hold down that's in a anchor bolt in the concrete. Just finished getting the back wall up and the little doorway to the restroom. Uh, Jose's working on the top plate up there. Moving, man. We're forging ahead today. It's going to be a little over 100 today, so uh, we're trying to get it done while it's still about 80. So it'll be heating up here. We're starting to sheet the outside. We got the uh, little restroom walls all studded out, installed. Probably hard to tell on the video right here, but anyway, they're in. It's gonna be a little toilet room with a sink and a toilet. Right about there. Got all our hold downs washered and nutted. For that one, still need to do some work on that one. So, got all these done, and now we're starting to sheet. The uh, whole building's getting uh, sheeted outside, and then we're going to work on the little uh, walls for the front entrance. I'll cut and bring you back. Here's a few clips of the front side. Uh, we still need to do the little five foot walls uh, for our 16 foot garage door opening. And there's the first sheet, the sheeting going up. By Jose. By Jose. <laughs> the best framer in the world. I gotta, I gotta, man, give these guys kudos. They are workers, man. Non-stop here, 6 a.m. in the morning, and they work all day long, man. And it's, it's like 100 degrees right now. Here's a framing update. We got the one wall and must all sheet it. Got the back wall and must all sheet it. And we're working our way around to this wall. Uh, we're waiting to hear back from the architect on our two front uh, five foot wall sections. We're having an issue with the tie down spacing and try to figure out how to hang our uh, blue lamp beam. It's going to be going 10 feet up all the way across here. Our wood pile is getting a lot smaller. There's our uh, blue lamb header for over the garage door. And these are our trim boards under here. Julia Park in the Bellagio Shopping Center and Julia at River Park have something for everyone this graduation season. Give the Alex and Ani graduation cap bangle to your 2017. There's Jose and Abe, the greatest framers in the Central Valley. Looking good, guys, looking good. Here's a shot between the uh, wall, which is the property line and side of the shop. Getting there. Today is Saturday, June 17th. 
exactly one week away from the Bar Z Industrial Summer Bash 2017. I was too tired last night to video uh, the completion of the day. Uh, the framers were here for uh, two days and I'll show you. Oh, and this morning the plumber and electrician came by. So I'll take you over and show you what uh, we got the, uh, the sewer pump all hooked up and running. I'll take you over there. So all the tie-ins have been completed now, both electrical and plumbing for the grinder lifter pump. Uh, we actually uh, tested it. Everything works flawlessly, man. Discharge works great. It flows uh, downhill nicely right to the sewer clean out. Um, the vent uh, works perfect and the power is roughed in. Basically, we ran it off an extension cord. So these lines here run in under the slab and I'll show you they pop up on the inside. Okay, so now we're in the toilet room. There's the uh, three, uh, three inch vent through the roof. Uh, there's the uh, sink drain. And then there's the uh, toilet flange there. And then electrical raw fin is right here. And that goes under the slab too. So that's all done. Uh, the whole outside is sheeted except we had to leave two open areas for inspection. Um, all our um, ties are all tied in tight. Uh, they're gonna be inspected on Tuesday, I believe. So everything's looking good, man. Here's our three inch electrical where our box is gonna be. Here's some more hold downs here. This is the front front short walls and there's our uh, our big uh, one foot glue lamb beam and that's a 10 foot high door opening uh, 16 feet wide uh, there's these short walls required two hold downs too so we got two of them there and then of course we have our stab bolts all the way around on the uh, pressure treated uh, base plate so uh, we got a lot of progress done yesterday. Everything's looking good, man. So um, there's your update. Um, we're not gonna be doing much more until after the Bar Z Summer Bash. So um, that'll give me a break, man. These guys work me hard, that's for sure. Anyway, our wood pile got a lot smaller. Uh, that's the sheeting for the roof. Roof trusses are due here next week. So the framers will come back and, and install the roof truss trusses and, and put the radiant barrier on top. And then we could have the roofer come in. So anyway, uh, thanks for coming along guys. I really appreciate it. I'm enjoying the build. I hope you guys are too. Um, I gotta tell you, man, it's been a lot of work, but uh, it'll pay off eventually. Um, it's coming along nicely. Look at that stupid dog. Guido, what are you doing? Well, I guess somebody's going to need another bath soon. So anyway, um, hope to see you all at the bash. Until then, take care. See ya.